I think this generation, specifically when it comes to love, is very, um, very impulsive and has a lot of problems with instant gratification. So what I've noticed with um, what I noticed with my generation is there's no falling in love anymore. It's just kind of like it's instantaneous. So the average relationship nowadays, I feel like, goes okay. I find you attractive. I find you attractive too. Okay, let's fuck. We fuck. Okay, I love you, even though I don't know you. Oh, I love you too, even though I don't know you. And I don't think that's how it should be at all. I feel like falling in love is something that happens very, very slowly. So, like, when you fall in love, a lot of people think it's about like the big things, where you're like, oh, they're they're pretty, like they they make money, they treat me well. That's not what falling in love is. That's what makes you because. See, love and falling in love is something completely different. You can love someone the first second you meet them, but you can't fall in love with someone. There's no, there's no such thing as love is first sight in that sense, because with with falling in love, it's the small things. It's like it's the way they eat their food, the way the way they sing their favorite songs, the way they get excited and passionate about certain things. It's that is what's falling in love. So, like, I'll use a personal example for me, like. So, like, one thing that makes me in love with my girlfriend is the way she eats food. She she eats it very slowly and and very, like, very, I guess, like, enjoyable. Like, like my girlfriend enjoys every bite of the food. And it's things like that that really make you fall in love with a person. And I feel like people don't even go on dates anymore, really. Like, like all the first dates I've been on in my life have just been, like the girl coming over my house and i i don't think that's any way to fall in love with someone like go smoke a cigarette by the train tracks for a first date go like go out to eat go do something that is actually going to get you to know the person rather than just inviting them over your house watching a movie and fucking them because it's everyone wants love to be something that's instant because they crave love so bad and that's another thing that is so fucked up about this generation. Um, and even some generations above mine is you, they don't get enough love from themselves or their friends or their family. So they search for love in their partners. And that is why they're so instantaneous with wanting to fall in love with someone because that's, that's all anyone wants. That's all human wants is love. And that's all we all are looking for our entire lives is love and happiness and contentness. But it's so much more beautiful when you slowly fall in love with someone versus falling in love with someone instantaneously. And another thing about love and this generation is a lot of relationships are built off of the wrong things. A lot of relationships are built off of hate or sex. Like, like, like I said, a lot of first dates I'm noticing now are people going over to other people's houses and having sex and then, oh, I love you. You can't love someone just based off of having sex with them and spending even a week with them. You can't love someone after a week because it's it's when you fall in love, you wanna you wanna look at that person and think, can I spend the rest of my life with this person? Do I see myself waking up next to this person every day and not getting sick of that person ever? Do I want to experience everything life has to experience with this person? And that's what you really have to look at when you're finding a partner. And I just, I, I think, I think this whole generation, and like I said, some above me, some below me, are too instantaneous when it comes to falling in love. And there's no beauty behind it anymore. And it's all mostly just like lust and um, lust, hatred. Like, like I know a lot of people that will get with people just to say they could, or just so someone else can't. And I was even the victim of that too, but I've realized that, like I said, falling in love is something that happens very slowly and it's something very beautiful. And people think that when you get into a relationship, the best part is being in that relationship and being able to call that person yours and all that stuff. But the best part about falling in a relationship is like the leading up, the actual falling in love and getting to love that person. And that's all I have to say. And go on dates and do romantic shit. That's the best thing I could say.